YouTube, what's good, man? You know who it is. Mike here, back again with another video. Any new viewers out there, yo, please subscribe. Um, you know, I just wanted to you know, make a video about this real quick. Y'all see the title, man. A Larry Merchant, you know, went on air. I think he went on uh, TMZ. He had an interview with TMZ yesterday. He basically said he's never watching the Floyd Mayweather fight ever again unless it's, you know, GGG, Gennady Golovkin. And, um, he basically... And then he went on to say, um, he said he won't, he won't watch because, you know, Berto is not a serious opponent. And he basically said Floyd is afraid to fight the guy everyone wants to see him battle, which is, um, GGG. And then, um, you know, GGG, he actually went on Timzy Sports, I guess, like, I don't know, hours after that. And then he basically said, you know, he'll beat Floyd ass and he'll put on the show. Uh, Larry Merchant, Larry Merchant, Larry Merchant. Um, I mean, let's be honest, y'all. I mean, Larry Merchant, he never really, you know, gave Floyd his props anyway. He always, you know, pretty much counted Floyd out, saying, you know, Floyd was, you know, every time he commentated, it's like he was always putting Floyd down. And he didn't think Floyd was going to do it. And then Floyd, you know, pretty much beat everybody that they put in front of him. And it's like everything Floyd be saying, like, it's like... Stuff he be saying, you know, like, years ago was pretty much coming to pass, like, years ago before he fought Pacquiao. Everybody wants to see that fight for, like, the past five years. What Floyd say? He said, when I beat Pacquiao, it's going to be an excuse. They're going to say Pac was over the hill, he was too small, he was this, he that. I mean, yo, y'all kept asking for the fight. I knew once Pacquiao got knocked out, I was like, I don't even want to see the fight no more. But people kept asking for it, and y'all got what y'all wanted. I, I didn't pay for it. I didn't lose any money on this. I'm pretty sure the ones that paid for it was upset, so I didn't, you know, I didn't pay for it, so I wasn't upset, so, um, you know, when Lloyd Merchant said he won't pay for a Floyd fight or watch another Floyd fight ever again, I mean, I mean, I don't know, man. I mean, Lloyd Merchant has his own opinion, everybody got their own opinion, I mean, Lloyd Merchant is, he's 75, 80 years old, I mean, I don't know, man, Floyd keeps, it's like stuff Floyd says is coming to pass, man, like, Floyd basically said they never gonna stop creating fighters, that's what they're doing. Um, you know, Floyd fought 22 world champions, 22 y'all. I'm pretty sure the comments going to come, y'all going to say, oh, he's a typical Flomo. And, you know, I know I already know what y'all going to say, man, so I'm prepared for it. Um, I'm not a Flomo. I'm not on anybody's side. I'm just speaking facts. So the facts are, man, Floyd is undefeated, and he fought 22 world champions. What fighter can y'all... Pick in history to sport 22 world champions and beat them all. Regardless of how he fought them, I don't care if he went toe to toe, if he boxed, if he did this, he did that. Can you guys get on the history and find out any world any world champion in the past that fought 22 world champions and beat every last one of them? If you can, comment below and you let me know. So, Marty Merchant, basically, you know, like I said, man, Floyd said they're never going to stop creating fighters. Um, you know, Floyd, first everybody wants to see Floyd fight, um, what's his guy name? Floyd fought Ortiz, and, um, you know, he beat Ortiz. In my opinion, Ortiz took a dive in that fight, but, you know, let's move on from that. And then everybody wanted to see him fight Cotto. He beat Cotto in a fight he went toe-to-toe. -to -toe. At that point, y'all was saying, y'all was still saying Floyd is born. Floyd, all he do is run, he do this and that. That fight, he went toe-to-toe -to -toe and beat Cotto. Nine rounds of three, in my opinion. And then um, he fought Mosley, even though, in my opinion, Mosley was done, but he beat Mosley. And then um, he beat, everybody was calling out, saying, put Canelo up there. Everybody amped up Canelo. Not, matter of fact, not to say Canelo wasn't any good, that doesn't take away the fact that Canelo is not good. Canelo's still a damn good fighter, just Floyd, you know, made him look like an average fighter. I mean, that's what Floyd do, man. He make, you know, fighters look like average fighters. I'm not, you know, giving my side of my opinion. I'm just basically, you know, speaking facts. Don't hit me up in the comment section talking about, you know, you're a hate nurse, nigga. You just on, you uh, you know, don't be, you know, talking shit about me. I'm just speaking facts. That's all I'm speaking is facts, y'all. So, uh, he beat Canelo. He beat Cotto. Y'all was asking for the Pacquiao fight for like the past five, six years. He beat Pacquiao. Now once he beat Pacquiao, oh, fight Triple G. If he fight Triple G and beat him, oh, he need to go ahead and fight Kovalev. If he fight Kovalev and beat him, oh, he need to go ahead and fight like... It's like y'all never gonna stop, so... Um, Larry Merchant, he, um... 
He feel as though Floyd is afraid to fight this guy. I mean, come on, man. Come on, Larry Merchant. Come on, man. It's like, I'm telling you, I swear, like, if he was to fight Golovkin, I'm just saying, hypothetically, hypothetically, y'all, if he was to fight Golovkin, I don't know, 154, let's say Golovkin keeps saying he can come out at 154, right? Let's say Golovkin come out at 54. Let's say, hypothetically, he beats Golovkin at 154. Then what y'all gonna say? He gotta go up to 175 and fight Kovala? I know that's what y'all gonna say. Y'all just gonna, like Floyd say, man, y'all never gonna stop creating fighters. He's gonna, you know, he's gonna beat this guy and y'all gonna say, oh, he need to, okay, go ahead and fight this guy. Okay, you beat him, uh, go ahead and fight that guy. Like, y'all never gonna stop. Like, y'all never gonna stop, man. I mean, I just don't know what it is about you guys is trying to, um, you know, get Floyd beat. I mean, I don't know. Man. I thought Pacquiao was, like, the end of this. I thought Pacquiao, I, I thought, like, once they were to be Pacquiao, I just thought everybody was gonna get off his case. And it's like, y'all ain't got off his case yet. Y'all still saying he need to fight this guy now. Y'all still saying he born. I mean, what do y'all want, man? Y'all tell me, what do y'all want? I don't understand what y'all want, so, um... I don't know, man. I mean, I don't know, man. Floyd Golovkin. Floyd don't even fight him. Floyd is 38. 48 fights. I mean, if you're an old fighter, I mean, what's the point of continuing to fight hard fights? I mean, if you um, go back in history, like, the greatest fight of all time, Muhammad Ali, his last fight, before he went on to fight Holmes and Burbank, his last fight was against a guy with seven fights. Once you get a certain age, you don't want to keep fighting, you know, hard, rough, and tough fighting. I'm, I'm pretty sure you guys are going to think, like, oh, Floyd never took any punishment, so technically Floyd is, like, 30, 32 years old. I mean, it is what it is, man. I mean, Floyd is 38, boxing is wearing turn about it. He never, obviously, took a lot of punishment, but, I mean, he do what he wanted at this point, man. So, y'all need to stop hating on him, saying he ain't fighting this guy. He's born, he's running. Like Floyd said, y'all don't want to watch him fight. Don't pay for it. Don't pay for it. You're going to keep complaining. You're going to keep paying for his fight. Stop fucking doing that. That don't make any damn sense. You don't want to look at it. Don't pay for it. Don't give him money for the pay-per-view. Shit, y'all let me know what y'all think of this, man. Larry Merchant going in on Floyd, man, and saying he's scared to fight GGG. And he won't watch another Floyd fight unless he fight GGG. I mean, it is what it is, man. He got his own opinion. Floyd don't need to fight in my opinion. So y'all just let me know what y'all think of that, man. And holler at my mouth, all right? Peace.